Michael, what's going on? Well, Bob, right now we are just steps away from Trinity Church over my right-hand shoulder here. Trinity Church, of course, home to many first responders after 9-11. And right now we are flanked, this Trump 2024 flag going down the heart of Broadway, flanked by several of NYPD, New York's finest. And I'm here with Miss Foxy from the Bronx. Miss Foxy, uh, you had an altercation with uh, an agitator before. We don't know if it was Antifa or, or do you. Uh, tell us about that experience. I would say it was an Antifa wannabe Black Lives Matter. And we do have Black Lives Matter, but they're always infiltrating. Just like what happened in January 6th, they try to pretend that they I think, were. I think we have footage of this, of this fight that happened about maybe 35 minutes ago. Uh, a Trump supporter and an agitator getting into fisticuffs. Uh, neither party decided to press charges. Uh, however, you can see that uh, things do get contentious whenever you have uh, Trump supporters meeting with Black Lives Matter or members of Antifa. Inevitably, where one is, the other is sure to follow. Right now, we'll take a look over here. Michael Shapiro, you're from New Jersey. New Michael, Jersey, yeah, you've got a, you've got, you're dressed for the uh, occasion, St. Patrick's right. Day. Uh, tell me, do you think uh, Andrew Cuomo, the governor of New York, is feeling as lucky as you do today? I hope so. I mean, I'm here. I'm here to make my best of it. Supporting President Trump, he should be out here. Excellent. All right. If you, if President Trump is watching this right now, what would you hope he uh, he gets from all of this? What what he hopes, what he gets out of this? Listen, we're here to show the love, the support, and the unity with everybody. All the Trump supporters that love him, that's that's why we're here today. Yeah, a lot we're of uh, St. Patrick's Day. A lot of uh, New York's. Police department, firefighters come from Irish descent. Uh, what, what do you have to say about uh, the presence that you're seeing around you protecting I, all I of you today? I want to say God, God bless all of the uh, New York police. I want to God bless President Trump and all the supporters that made it out of here today. I want to thank everybody, and I want to wish everyone a happy St. Patrick's Day today. All right, well. Thank you very much. Thank you, Michael. As you see, God a different kind America. of... A different kind of St. Patrick's Day today here on Broadway in New York City. We'll be following this Trump 2024 flag as it makes its way down Broadway, down through Wall Street. Uh, this event slated to end at an Irish pub, so a lot of these folks will probably be imbi imbibing some beverages here in a little bit. I think they've reached Wall Street. What's going on, Michael? <sighs> That's right, Bob. We have reached Wall Street right over my shoulder here. You can see the infamous Wall Street Bull. Uh, we are in the heart of Wall Street, right at the tip of the island, really. Um, and over here on my right, Alexi, you've kind of been leading this march today. You've got the bullhorn here. You've got some agitators around, but for the most part, it's been pretty peaceful. Talk about the presence uh, out here on St. Patrick's Day. Well, it's somewhat peaceful. We've already had several fights break out, a few brawls. The ideology of Antifa is amongst us, and uh, Joy Bayer should come out and say hello because she doesn't think they exist, but uh, clearly they're here. Yeah, There's one We've got a little agitator right here, actually. And take a look over here. NYPD been guarding everyone around here. We'll, we won't show that. We don't need to show that. We'll send it to you, Bob and Heather, right now. Things are getting a little heated out here on Broadway. Mike, we were just talking earlier about how you're a big guy, so we need a big guy out there right now. You can block some of that <laughs> uh, messiness that's happening. Yeah, be careful. Right. Be careful out there. All right, Michael.